Today I thought I would show you uh, two things. Now the first thing, I don't know what the technical name is, but uh, people have referred to it as color blocking. I will be using Adobe Photoshop Elements, so this should work on all versions or editions, including the full Photoshop. Uh, Elements is just uh, bits and pieces that uh, are the low-end version for people who don't want to spend a lot of money but want to be able to use Photoshop. So the first thing I will show you is, uh, like I said, the color blocking. And uh, basically you use the selection tool and then you uh, go up to uh, the top here and select uh, enhance and then adjust color and then adjust hue and saturation. So we'll quickly start that. So you take the quick selection tool put it down in the bottom corner of the picture and just kind of go along the edge of the picture now here I have to move over a little bit so it gets underneath my shirt sleeve and then at the co bottom corner I just have to move it in a little bit because that uh, speaker uh, in the corner there um, wants to show up so now I just go over to enhance, adjust color, adjust hue, saturation, and then you want to drag the saturation all the way to the left. So it's at negative 100, and then click OK. And as you can see, the color in the background is now uh, black and white, or it ha most of the color is removed so that only myself in the picture is colored. Now the second thing I want to show you is how you can change out the background so it's still selected from using the quick selection tool and then you want to use the move tool and you just basically move the background like that and then go up to edit, delete and then after you delete it, you go down to the Magic Eraser tool and make sure it's on Magic Eraser tool and go like that. And now you can take this sample background that I have here or another background that you would like to use, put it there, and then switch to the Move tool and then take this one and go bring to front and then take the background image and drag it up into position so that looks okay right there and now you just right click that image here under layers uh, the background image and click merge visible and then you may want to use auto smart fix even though it probably looks better without that and then now you just basically go save as uh, or save so that's two things that I can show you how to do on Adobe Photoshop Elements and hopefully this video was helpful subscribe or visit my channel